cannot believe we finally made it. I am so excited about the day. It's just been absolutely phenomenal. Doing this again reminded me of when we first started in the last year. Um, because with COVID, it was really hard, you know, we couldn't do a lot of things. Trying to keep connected with the young people was tough. All of the groups that we worked with were having a hard time. And yet here we are with an amazing tournament at Guards Polo Club, and it's all sponsored by Outsourcing. Today, it's the celebration of everyone's hard work. It's actually the first time people get to be together around this event. It's really a moment for all of us to take stock of what we've done. Today is when we actually put everything into practice. We still are a team, and I think we're going to be keeping in touch with each other forever, to be quite honest. So we have Change Your Line as the strap line, which is the polo way of saying change your life. Underpinning it is the science of changing the way you think. And I think there's two things to that is, one is like reprogramming how you react to things. And then the other one is being inspired to overcome some challenges and believing that your life can be better. I've always found polo and horses to be a massive escape from these stresses of mine. I've also been able to um, speak a lot to the people involved with the charities and they've become a massive pillar of support. I think this has uh, boosted my confidence to try new things. When I'm playing, I forget about all my problems and I love like, making friends with the horses and I love talking to them. So the pay it forward effect that you have in a lot of charities, we're beginning to see much more of it. First and foremost, it's doing something which is so extraordinary to everyone's lives to be on a horse and to play polo. Just that one message about I have done this and I have learned from it is such a catalyst for, for change elsewhere. Being surrounded with people who have done well and who are successful and sharing, them sharing their stories is really a big part. And now that we've come here, we've conquered fears and we've done all this stuff. So now when we go back, it's gonna be like a new start. Polo has a place, a real place, to make real social difference. And we're grateful to have partnered with the Power of Polo so that our veterans and our serving and you know, the bereaved and the local community can benefit from the work that, that Katie and her team are doing through Power of Polo. Big change happens with little movements and with, uh, with little steps. And I think that's something that we're doing here. I think that Polo can have a social return, that we have a model that can do that and that we've developed it. We still have to develop it further. We can make it better, stronger, bigger, but ultimately we can use this sport to help people from all different walks of life in a way that is meaningful and appropriate. And we proved that today.